Within two seconds. Oh. Jesus. Hi guys, Brain Scare Lion back with another no, video. No, 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 this is my video now. Because, um, you got it wrong. Like, like, you, all you had to do was not get any right, like, any wrong. Uh, so this is my video now. So basically this punishment is coming out for one of the worst fucking pay-per-views I have ever seen in my life. Yeah, which makes this even more sweet. I'm taking over. Um, I'm going to be asking whatever the hell I want. And I have to answer it honestly. And then somewhere, somehow, where I'm going to slap him. Uh, after the interview is done, but she's not going to be telling me when the interview is over. No, I don't know if you remember when we did the Q&A with Tom. Uh, I turned around and they asked what my favourite thing about the YouTube video was, and I said, seeing you in pain. Yeah. So this is perfect for me, because this is like a dream come true. This is literally coming after he was it. We, we only just did a punishment video. Oh wait, by the way! Jesus. I thought she was going to fucking belt me. <laughs> Not yet. Right, uh... There we go. You know what you, know, you want to do, right? As soon as I saw it, I wanted to do that. Are you ready? It's a fucking unicorn horn. Are you ready? Uh, I'm ready, I'm ready, let's go. Let's do this. Brian the Scary Lion. I'm, I'm going to ask you some questions. You've got to answer honestly. So swear on the unicorn book that you'll say nothing but the truth. So help the unicorn gods. I swear wholeheartedly, so help the unicorn gods that I will tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. But... Quick heads up, if anything needs to be bleeped, it will be bleeped. I will not have personal names or anything revealed. I need to protect anonymity for people. Mm. <laughs> Are you ready? Right. First one is pretty easy. Okay. What was the last stupid thing you bought? The last stupid thing that when I, I bought? When I mean stupid, I mean something that you really should have got, that you have no need for. I bought eyeliner. Uh, this is a weird story. Basically, I wanted to kind of see what I'd look like if I just showed on the outside how I feel on the inside, and that's just pure black, everything black, black like black eyeshadow, black lipstick. I was going to go the full ten. Do you know what? Oh, yeah. If you want to see that, I'll happily make that happen. <laughs> uh, put it in the comments, please. You don't have an actual. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Are you ready for the next question, Brian? Next question, here we go. Who was your first crush? Who was my first crush? Uh, my first crush? See, this would have been easier if it was like biggest crush. I can remember that. Okay then! Biggest crush! Alright, well, uh, that would have been... <laughs> now tell her how you felt. No! It's an interview, I need to answer honestly, but I don't need to sit here and go how I felt. You do. That's not because, right. not because I've got a story coming in another video later. Good answer, I was head over heels for this last year, like, uh, full on fucking head over heels. Uh, as you will have seen, the name is being bleeped up because I'm protecting fucking anim anonymity. I will reveal nobody's personal anything. What was the name again? Six reasons why you're amazing. Uh, you're a bit of a twat. That, 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 that's just like one of the qualities you've got to have to be my friend. If you're a twat, you're in good women. I'm actually the biggest one out of the group. Uh, you like similar games and stuff. Like You like to play Halo Starring. and Gears of War. Gears of War is like our, our game. Uh, it's the, one of the first games that we just fully connected on. Sorry, I'm just enjoying this. Come on, carry on. Um, this is hard as hell. Sophie's redeeming qualities. She doesn't have many. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, 
No, she's she usually keeps things entertaining. Like uh, if shit starts to get boring, she usually picks things up a bit. As you can tell on these videos. <gasps> I don't have many friends that I can actually geek out with, which is good. I can geek out with Sophie. I'll go with a serious one. We've both been for a similar like stuff, which if anything's brought us kind of closer. <laughs> uh, I'm such a vibe. <laughs> and. Fifth, another serious one, but this one's really good. Um, she's been supportive of me, like, through everything that I've done here. Like, I, I thought of, um, I will not lie, I thought about getting up a couple of times. She's kept me going. She's kept me going. I'll never be able to slap you if you did. <laughs> Sorry, one minute, I'm just enjoying that. Oh, fuck off. Move on, you big headed bastard. <laughs> oh, God. Read your family members! From best to worst, Mum, Cara, Liz, Graham, Tom. From best to worst. Well, you know who's going to be at the top. Yeah. Cara's at the top. And then just below Cara, Tom. Right, but that, that, okay. Uh, no, family gatherings will be a lot awkward, but. <laughs> Uh, no, this is a fucking difficult one. How do you rate your family members? <laughs> uh, it probably have to be my mum after that. Because, truthfully, uh, well, I grew up in England and my gran and my sister grew up in Scotland. So... I've been to a dickhead. Uh, <laughs> I've only really known them for... Like, actually known, like, met them and things for, like, a couple of years, really. So, I don't know which order to put them in, but I put them just afterwards. It's not anything like personal. It is. <laughs> it's okay. It's just she made me do this. I, I, if you want, to my full family, if you want to be angry at any cunt for that, Sophie. Oh, fair play with you, unicorn. Next, who would you turn gay for? Who would I turn gay for? Wait! Celebrity Ooh. and then non-celebrity. Celebrity and then non-celebrity. Uh, I don't think I've got any non-celebrities. No, honestly, I don't think I've got any non-celebrity. Uh, celebrity. Slap your silly face. <laughs> celebrity, if I want to go get one. Uh, oh, well, I think I'm not going to lose, because you've told me this many times. Ryan Reynolds. Oh, we switched. It used to be Channel 10. You should have heard how he talks about Channel 10. No, it's but scary. that was joking, uh, like, in a weird way. This one isn't joking. <laughs> Unicorn. I am not ashamed of my sexuality. I am straight with confusion thoughts. A nun? Uh, so so I, I don't think I've got a nun. So like this isn't even like me trying to avoid because well I don't really Okay, who who do you but... know around that is the most attractive that's a boy? Who's my most who's the most attractive male friend I've got? <laughs> God, this is irritating my head. Can I fucking take it off? No! I don't know. Yeah? Oh, uh, it works. Right! Which of my sisters have you liked? <laughs> the name's gotta be cut out again. Why? Oh, because it is. What's your weirdest sexual dream you've had? The weirdest sexual dream I've had? Uh, well basically, it all started out with And that was the last time I'd ever been tickled there. I can't make you fun. I've been dying, so I should go for your balls. <laughs> no, fuck you. Go fuck yourself. Nah, nah, nah. It's not happening. It's not, it's not happening. It's not happening. I want you to say, I being saying that about you. I am the prettiest unicorn and I want to I want you to slap me, Queen Sophie. What kind of fucking interview is this? In an interview you don't get asked to say shit. I asked you, you do! No, I have to answer honestly. I will uh, uh, honestly answer that. No. Say it. No. Say it. No. Or I get to slap you twice. <laughs> that, that, that's just not in the rules. It's just not. But it's my this is, It's an interview. <laughs> this is an interview. You don't go, hear monkey say, monkey do. But you are a monkey. I'm no fucking monkey, I'm a unicorn. What porn do you watch the most? 
Well, basically, uh, the sort of videos that I watch the most are these ones where. And seriously, I, en I, I seem to enjoy a lot of tickling. <laughs> tickling seems to be a big thing. What is the worst thing about Tom? The worst thing about Tom? Uh, it's quite a lot. His anger, his anger is a fucking bastard. Like he had a phone that I got, it, it got after me for two days and then he fucking broke it. Because he was angry at it. Without saying names. Right. I want you to look at the camera and give a message to someone you don't like. To my father, go fuck yourself. Leave him with it. Come he, on. He may, uh, no, I'm le I'll leave it in to my, to my, well, to my birth father. To my fucking donor. Aye, uh, donor. Uh, go fuck yourself. You've been out in my life my whole fucking life. Why should I I'm that? his daddy now. <laughs> that tattoo is basically for somebody else, yes, not the person I'm talking about. What is the worst thing you've done to Tom? Worst thing I've done to Tom, this, this, this one's a good one. Tom, Tom was meant to clean his room, right? And uh, when he was meant to clean his room, he decided, do you know what, I'm not fucking cleaning it. And I was forced to clean the fucking room. And because of the fact that I cleaned it, it I was pissed off and I went in to my mum's room, grabbed the makeup, Went in while my brother was asleep on my bed. He took over my fucking bed and I plastered makeup all over him. The worst part about it was he couldn't get it off. What's the worst thing you've ever done to me? Worst thing that I've ever done to you? Uh, I think I called you a slag at one point. she forgets that back when I used to drink a lot, I don't remember anything from those days. Oh, she caught me right under the fucking ear. Oh, I guess that means the interview is done. If, if, you've got, if you've got another question, like, oh, she caught me like right under the jaw. It's not even like she went hard, she just put enough on it so that it has that little sting. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I, I can't slap her. Do you know, uh, shall we tell them about what I said before this? If you want. Sure I you was want. like, what if I punch you by accident? Because mm. if I, I, it's not that I want to, but. <laughs> she go right on. <laughs> but when I panic, I do this, don't I? It's just mm. a natural thing. So knowing my look, I would have knocked him out. He would have been on the floor, and I'd be I like, "I've been knocked out. <laughs> I've been knocked out. Be taken off now." Um, so that was the interview. Um, did you enjoy your slap? You got me right under the jaw. <laughs> this is the strangest fucking interview I've ever done. <laughs> but I want to say uh, thank you for watching. I don't know, like. What this is going to be like for you guys, but this fucking hilarious for me. And uh, at least you got to know our brain some more and how he calls me a slag. And I only ever did that once. Twice. Not once, Twice. it was during a big breakup. And then, so I want to say thank you for letting me hear. Oh, that's right. Thank you for watching. Press the like button and. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe. He needs it so I can knit him more. And um, if you want to see him, like I said, if you want to see me goth him up, put it in the comment. Like anything, put anything in the comment. We'd like to hear what you're saying. And you might as well roar. Uh, uh, I've got a day my usual. Uh, I know she already said hit that like button, but if you like the video, don't forget to butt fuck that like button. <laughs> and then, um, roar. Please. Peace.